Hi, I'm here with Freddie Lozano of AECOM. Freddie, I understand you're one of the CAD managers over at AECOM. Yes, I am. I'm one of the uh, many CAD managers. We have regional CAD managers. I am CAD manager based in New York. Um, the, the, the way I became CAD manager was I was at a, a previous firm for 15 years. Uh, was the CAD manager, the IT manager, the uh, software purchaser, and I needed my 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 knowledge base to to grow. So, kind of hit the wall where I was, and I basically said, "Let me go to New York and see what's out there for me." And I did that, and I was lucky enough to join AECOM. Um, at that time, the name was different, but uh, again, I was. Uh, curious to see how things were done in the big city. So you've been doing CAD management for over 15 years now, is that right? Uh, yes. So what got you into it in the first place? Uh, curiosity. I always wanted to see how things would, would make it better for me to, to, to get to the next level, um, make it easier to work for me. Because I kept asking people standards, standards, and they kept pointing me to go talk to him, go talk to that, and they all kept pointing to the same person. Nobody knew exactly because standards wasn't uh, the big thing back then. And I kind of saw standards being a big key in you know, productivity, and sort of when I came to AECOM, I was one of the few that started asking questions of what are the company standards, and, you know, since companies of this magnitude keep buying other companies, standards keep integrating. So, like I said, we try to establish a, a CAD manual, and we did that successfully. Um, it, it's a hard, you know, subject to deal with because, mm -hmm. you know, a lot of people need to they don't want to book this thick. They want to streamline it, make it easier, and uh, that's 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 how it became that. So you, you ask enough questions, and they put you in charge. Is that right? Yeah, I was the guy who said, "Well, he's been asking a lot of these questions." So he, no, basically, it was a lot of my, my solutions to the to the problems that the company seemed to appreciate. Um, I took a lot of my own time to learn things outside mm -hmm. of the company to show them that I was very eager to take them to the next level or career path-wise that I knew that in, in the long run it will affect how I would do my work because I'm very I'm a productive guy in, in the CAD uh, field so I I very uh, how can I say um, it was a long and hard journey to where I'm, at. I'm not saying it's over yet still got a lot to learn with, with the new, new software that helps out there right now um, and it's just been a pleasure um, having gotten too many gray, hair, gray hairs yet, but I'm sure they're coming. <laughs> well, that's great. Thanks so much, Freddie, and Thank thanks you. for joining us.